Hello and welcome to Kentucky Brew Reviews. I'm Radar. Special K, and this is our first ever episode of Beer Mail that we're actually going to put up. We've had other ones, <laughs> but we've had issues. So uh, we do have a P.O. box. People do ship us beer sometimes. We're going to go and open this one on camera. I did sort of open it uh, because there was some glass rattling around in there, and I went ahead and pulled the broken glass off the top, but we have not went through the package. Uh, and this is from Jim in Wisconsin. It is. So he wrote us a Thanks, letter. Jim. He wrote read? us an entire letter. So do you want to read the uh, letter? To the Kentucky Brew Review crew, I hope everything in this package arrived intact. I think I did a good job packing, but you know the UP USPS can break anything. I got it. It did. Enclosed are two beer schooners, one Hams, one Paps, and they would be listed as vintage on eBay. They date back to the mid-1970s. I found about a dozen of them while cleaning out my mom's house and thought you guys would appreciate a couple. Also enclosed are two Wisconsin beers. The Milkshake Malt Porter is from Point Brewery, Stevens Point, Wisconsin. I paid $8.99 for a six-pack. That's not bad. Mm -hmm. uh, that's, that's really actually not bad. They've been brewing beer since 1857. That's an old brewery. Uh, Point made their name brewing Point Special Lager. They have sold many a case and a keg to college kids as Steve's Point. Yes, yes, yes it is. Uh, all right. Uh, they used to sell uh, just in Wisconsin, but started to branch out in 1990. They can be found throughout the Midwest states, as far as south, as far south as Ohio, Indianapolis, Illinois, Missouri, and Kansas. Ooh, they just barely missed us. Mm. That's very sad. It's very sad. Uh, the other beer enclosed is New Glorious. New Glorious. New Glorious, Glorious brewing Glorious. product. Wisconsin being Belgian red, and since you reviewed the New Glorious Spotted Cow, that, that's right. You know their products are available in Wisconsin. Oh, there's, there's pieces of there's pieces of glass. Yeah, it's a good thing that didn't happen. Uh, yes, uh, you know their products are only available in Wisconsin. I paid uh, ten fifty for the four pack. Woo! At Belgian Red, at my age, I drink beer for taste, not for effect. So I'm always looking for a new beer to try. This is the first beer I tried that taught me how complex beer can be. That's always a really important beer. There are a lot of things going on in the palate with this. Oop, oh, I'm not going to read that part. You didn't uh, read this before, did you? No, I didn't read it. Oh, okay. I'm going to skip past that. Uh, you, live in Bur uh, you live in bourbon country. Before the major breweries either closed or consolidated Wisconsin and Minnesota were home to the most of the major beer brands. Not, I can't read through your paper. <laughs> Not sure what the microbrewery scene is like in Kentucky. Here in Wisconsin and Minnesota, there are microbreweries all over the place. Hope everything made it there in one piece, and you enjoy. Cheers, Jim in Wisconsin. Thank you, Jim in Wisconsin. So we we have, will uh, enjoy, in fact, so as I mentioned, your, uh, your beers. There was a PBR uh, goblet in there, or not a PBR, so yeah, a ham goblet, goblet that yes. broke, and there's still glass all over the box. A little, a little bit. Um, but we got this awesome PBR one. Now we have a matching set, because I had one. Oh, yeah. There you so go. Open that one. I'll open this one. Let's see what we got in here. I see he's been watching our beer these, shipping. These he's been watching our beer, beer shipping videos. Yes. This is the way to ship beer. I gotta say, these Tyvek envelopes are fantastic. All right. They are see. free. Yeah. Nice bubble wrap. That's, that's good. I'm gonna try and yeah, slid it out like a newborn beer. All right, so I have, ooh. <laughs> so yeah, I have the new Galerius, uh, Wisconsin Belgian Red, and I have glass chunks all over my hands. All nah, right. That's fine. Uh, Bruden, we've had some new Galerius beers before. That's a, that's um, a good looking Funny beer. thing is my mother-in-law just sent me a picture of this beer. She said she had it, um, somebody yeah. brought it back to her. No when kidding. she had tried it. I'm like, that's funny. I was like, I think, I was like. We, we happen to have some of that too. Right, so. Um, what is that one? The I uh, like this. I like this label a lot. Uh, that is the point milkshake. Malt. It looks like a, like a malt porter. Like a malt, like an ice cream shop. Yeah, it does. It uh, it reminds me of like a like a soda you would buy from an ice cream parlor. So uh, we did. We have done. We've done spotted cow on the mm -hmm. show, and we've mm -hmm. done two or three other ones, but they were really bad. So we never actually uploaded the videos of those. Um, but well, apparently cow is he delicious. likes this one. He likes yeah. this one a lot. This one looks good. Uh, I do like. A, Breads, so yes. we'll see. So I'm looking forward to doing champion. reviews on this. It's got cherries on it, so I'm curious if it's like a fruit. Well, he it said it was really complex. I didn't read 
what he thought was complex about it. I just skipped that paragraph. But, but I'm uh, looking forward to it. It says it's got intense carbonation and strong cherry flavor. And it's like a champagne. A champagne? Champagne. A champagne. And this one doesn't have a description apart from milkshake malt porter. So I'm going to say this yeah. is probably a porter. So we'll probably, uh, we'll definitely review these. They'll probably be up probably within three to four weeks after we upload this video. It takes us some time to get to stuff. We only shoot yeah. a couple times a month. Um, if you guys are interested in shipping us some beer, uh, we'll leave the link uh, in the description below how to do it. We have a video on showing how to properly ship it, and then yep. we also, I'll leave my PO, our P.O. box. Or you can scroll over to the About page, and the P.O. box is down towards the bottom. Uh, we do ask that you do not ship uh, entire six packs that are not properly wrapped, because we've had that. That's a terrible idea. A couple times. They will be uh, smashed and disposed of in the mail. Yeah, they'll uh, throw them away in the thing, so. Um, but yeah, thanks to uh, Jim for sending this beer. It's awesome. I'm looking forward to trying these. There's no way we probably would have got our hands on these any other way. I'm looking forward to drinking out of this. You can drink with that glass. That yes, I am. I'm glass gonna, chunks I'm going to drink both of these. Well, I'm, I'm going to take the glass out first. Yeah. I'm going to drink both of those out of this. You know, when I, when I saw Guaranteed. the broken hams glass, I was so sad. Oh, yeah. I was like, I've never seen a hams glass before. I just so. bought a 30-pack of hams. And I saw the picture, and I was like, yes! And then it was broken, and I went, no! Yeah. Because, yeah. yeah. We'll have to do some Goodwill searches. We'll probably yes. find some at some point. It'll be important. But all right, that's been our episode. If there's something you'd like to see on the channel, you can leave a comment down below. Don't forget to hit that like button. I'm Special K. I'm Radar. Thanks for Thank watching. Thank you for watching.